All right, so Tesla had record vehicle deliveries in Q3, 241,300 vehicles delivered. This beats the previous record set last quarter. Q2 had 201,250 deliveries, and Tesla even beat Wall Street's expectations, which were already high. Now, a shout out here to Hypercharts because it's hard to picture these numbers without some visuals. So here it is. And it's so great to see the lines just going higher and higher. And we finally got our little underline back, a little Model S and X sales. Oh, yeah. The little red down at the bottom there. Yeah, here's a breakdown between the Model S and X sales and the 3 and Y sales. And you may be saying that's kind of low, but it's a lot higher than the previous quarter when only 2,340 were delivered. So now there's about 9,000 delivered this quarter. And that's because Tesla had just started production again of the Model S and X. Right. And I mean, although those delivery numbers are low, we're talking about like they're selling plaids, they're selling very high priced Model S's again. Um, I think that this is definitely going to help their profit margin. Yeah. With Giga Berlin and Giga Texas hopefully coming online by the end of this quarter, Q4, Tesla could be hitting an annual production rate of over 1 million vehicles by the end of this year. Hey, everybody. Thanks so much for watching Now You Know Clips. You can watch full episodes of Tesla Time News on Mondays and in-depths on Fridays. Just click the link down below to head over to the Now You Know channel.